Mystery Man here. We're going to do a new thing or let's play a theme park tycoon 2. Yeah. Gonna do the tutorial. Quite easy. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh, come. Yeah. Just listen to that. So, uh, yeah, this game is kind of like a retailing game where you control uh, this theme park and all that stuff. Yeah, it's pretty uh, simple if you think about it. That's new. So yeah, this game is technically game where you kind of like expand a theme park, kind of like take control of it. Slushy, hot drinks, candy floss. Yep, pretty much. Um, pretty much. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of like just that. And yeah, I'll make this uh, one. I just don't want every one to think, hey, this is so expensive, I'm leaving. <laughs> And then I'm coming back. Oh, see you bye. Hmm. You should uh tell me uh what I should uh make a theme on of my park and uh yeah. You should tell me uh, what theme I should do and what colors I should put and what I should not. If you like, and I'll pick the most liked theme of all. Or the most recommended. If people comment, I'm not sure. I'm just using this as an example. What should I? For example, a 
Oh yeah, my example is uh, if like someone uh, did Five Nights at Freddy's theme and people liked it the most, I'd pick that. Or if a person uh, comments uh, down below and other people come below the same idea and it's higher than the likes, we'll see about having their idea. I mean, like, honestly, it's just your choice, guys. So, yeah. And I've already uh, made a theme park about Five Nights at Freddy's. So that's why I'm uh, using this suggestion thing. So, yeah. Just really, it's, it really just depends on you guys. So yeah, and just tell me what sh colors I should uh, use and not use. Same with the thing, if I should really use uh, blue or not use red and stuff. And if I just can't pick any theme, yeah, I I'm, I'm just going to go with random colors and without theme. But hey, it all depends on you guys. So yeah, I think I'll end it off for this video. See you next time, Mystery Man is out.